Everybody's dancing to their own drummer. Ah, oh, <laughs> uh, somebody's playing my song. The ice cream truck? That's the Hallelujah Chorus. How about I get us all the treats? How do we know you're gonna get what we like? Because I get everything there is. Daddy, I don't want you to get everything there is. Oh, why not, precious? Because I want you to get two of everything there is. That's my baby. Yeah, right. I made it. Read it and weep. Too hip for you to know. Cool. What are you talking cool? This shirt is dissing you. Uh-uh. I don't get dissed. Because Mama says I am so in steam. <laughs> <laughs> you want to see my pet bug? Girl's daddy got a gajillion dollars, and she picking up bugs for pets. That Robin Leach is always saying. The rich are different from you and May. <laughs> yeah, they stupid. <laughs> Give me that. Orale, you know what they call that bug back in Mexico? An appetizer? <laughs> La cucaracha, gringo estúpido. Tú que sabes, pues ya estuvo bueno porque yo soy Mauricio. Boy, boy, boy. <laughs> you sound a lot like Ricky Ricardo, man. Babalu! <laughs> Hey, ever put a cockroach in the microwave? They go off like firecrackers. Oh, I can see everybody's working real hard on their homework. But they were gonna help me with my science project. Uh-huh. Bubba, have you been using my green fountain pen again? This ain't it, is it? Isn't it? Oh, it ain't it? <laughs> no, Vanessa. It's not it ain't it. It's it isn't it. And yes, that is it. <laughs> Thank you. And get your feet down. I know all this is and ain't stuff. I just love watching her go mental. <laughs> you keep away from my Bubba's bug. Charlie, there's plenty where he came from. Bugs do it like bunnies. <laughs> <laughs> do what? Huh? No, little girl. The wild thing. The humpty hump. The hump? It. Sex. Oh, sexy like beer commercials. Sexy ain't beer. <laughs> sexy is people. Two people. The word. Huh? Here it is. You know something? People... Now, this is a conversation that I would really rather have with my children in private, which this is not. Thank you very much. Busted. <laughs> I scream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream. Oh, there's definitely going to be some screaming. George, honey, sweetheart, I am happy you care. I am proud you care. I care, too, but these kids, they, they need limits. They need a structure. Yeah, like a jail cell. Stop helping. <laughs> Stop. 
They were structured to be doing their homework. So what? They come over here, they do a little homework, they have a little dinner, then they proceed to educate our children on the Humpty Hump. <laughs> Nursery rhymes. What's wrong with that? Bad answer. Stop helping. Okay. <laughs> George, honey, it's getting difficult for me. Already at school, it's... Hey, Maggie, yo, Maggie. <laughs> Baby, it's getting personal, and I'm starting to lose the distance that is necessary to maintain proper authority. Distance? Uh huh. I don't think you like these kids. Excuse me? I am the one that gave up a very good job in a very nice private school to help these children. I am dedicated to helping these children. I don't have to like them. I don't think you meant that the way it sounded. Helping. <laughs> now, George, these children need more than we can give them here. Honey, they need space. They need light. They need to play. They, they need a, a place. They need their place, not my place. Their place. You're right. Oh, 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 boy, you're right. You know, Maggie, you're a genius. You're like, what's his name, uh, the kid? Uh, uh, Warwick, uh, uh, wrote symphonies, uh, uh... Mozart? Exactly, except you're a woman genius. So, uh, you know, like, uh, uh, what's her name? Uh, a little blonde lady hung out in Africa, uh, picked nits off the monkeys, uh... uh, uh Jane Goodall. Jane Goodall, a genius just like you. Mm. How exactly am I a genius, George? A club. That's exactly what the kids need. That's a good idea. I'll buy them one. Honey, uh, you don't need to buy them a building. A genius again. <laughs> oh, ugh. you're right. I don't need to buy another building. I already own the building. The savings alone went belly up. <laughs> I've got a whole floor vacant. It's got everything these kids need. Oh, it's got space. It's got light. Yeah, it's got... locked vaults, surveillance cameras, snarling attack dogs. <laughs> huh. <laughs> Here we go. This is it. Our new boys and girls club. Come here after school. Bring all your little friends. Yo, get some stuff straight, Pops. Number one, we ain't no boys and girls. Number two, we ain't got no little friends. <laughs> and number three, I ain't coming here after school. Number four, ain't isn't a word. And number five, this isn't a club. Ain't that the truth? <laughs> Oh, Lathan. <laughs> what a good surprise. Glad that you could join us here. Hey, I ain't joining nothing. I'm waiting for D. We got business. <laughs> Suit yourself. Now, speaking of business, I want to do a little brainstorming. How about we get together and put up a little wish list, okay? What would it take to make this place cool? I know. Me hanging here, vato. <laughs> Shut up. Now you mean like, okay, what if we had some sounds? Like, get us a CD? See, that's the way. One CD player. And some big old hog speakers. Video games. And a pool table. And a refrigerator. <laughs> Make that two refrigerators. One for him and one for everybody else on the planet. <laughs> Here's the deal. I provide the space. You work to make the place. Work? Yeah, work. It's that thing where you accomplish something. Sit along with me. Work, it won't hurt. <laughs> Maybe start your own business. Me and my brother, we built little bird houses. <laughs> Ooh, tough guy building bird houses. <laughs> you got something against little birdies having a home? Spencer, I have haciendas for birds. That's cool. <laughs> Good, okay. Come on now, y'all. Let's think. Income. Ooh, I know, I know, I know, I know. What? What about T-shirts? You sold that two-hip shirt to V for $15. You go, girl. Install a light bulb over this child's head. I like that. T-shirt business. I said we call the two-hip ink company Shasta Roberta Rhodes. B-O-S-S, -S, boss. Who says you're the boss? Didn't you hear who just said it? No, I don't think so. Well, you better stop thinking. Actually, I'll be the president because I'll write the checks. El jefe, like Victor Kayam of T-shirts. I liked it so much, I bought the company a sis. <laughs> yeah, just like Victor, only bigger and better. <laughs> and bolder. <laughs> but in 
a good way. <laughs> Take these and put them on the table over there. Vanessa, go put them in stacks. Okay. Tell you the truth, George. It's creative, it's structured, it promotes teamwork and responsibility. Hm. You might have hit on something really good here. Well, it was Vanessa's idea, and the T-shirt was Shasta's own design. I'm impressed. Well, I'm not impressed. The man works hard so his babies can labor in a sweatshop. Horrible. <laughs> Reminds me of the little match girl. I hate that show. Always makes me cry. That and those AT&T commercials with all that reaching out and touching him. You finished. For now. <laughs> all right, come and get him. Well, Lathan, you too, huh? Hey, I'm a businessman. And you smell of good business, huh? Me. Ah, uh, well, that's the American dream. Go on and get your piece of that pie. <laughs> Now, since you're so good at being bossy, <laughs> boss, I'm giving you this book. It's for keeping track of your expenditures like a real business. Cool. Look, here's the deal. We took a vote and instead of your stupid idea of calling the place the Boys and Girls Club, we're calling it the TKO. Stands for the Total Knockout. No, no, actually it stands for technical knockout. <laughs> well, not here it don't. <laughs> stands for we're hot. You know, we're like total knockouts. We thought of it because of you. <laughs> but it's not like an honor of you or anything. <laughs> and it's not like a compliment. More what you call a coincidence. You know what we mean. Oh, yeah, I know. <laughs> that was a compliment. No, no, that was a coincidence. <laughs> Great, big, wonderful coincidence. This is such a touching moment. Makes me feel a little sick. Oh, Juanita, you're sick. Why don't you take something? Like what? Like the bus home. Sixty-two shirts, eighteen bills a pop. What happening, D? Homes. TKO's only charging fifteen. Well, what do you know? Guess we just gonna have to give them back their change, huh? Psych! <laughs> man, I don't know, man. I think it'd be stupid to play them. I mean, stealing from the former world heavyweight champion of the whole world? Not to mention, Shasta. <laughs> they gonna get their money. Look, D, it's like a loophole. Rich guys do it all the time. <laughs> yeah, but, but Baldy's trying, you know, teaching us business and math and stuff. Yeah, well, D, you know me. I'm humming at math. 62 shirts times three bucks profit, that's, uh, $186. That much? <laughs> well, that's the kind of math I can get into. You with me? Yeah, I guess. I am a housekeeper, not a fry cook. They earn these fine burgers. You said it, Pops. We deserve a break today. Then why not get up and go away? Juanita, I know deep down, way deep down, you're actually a nice lady. That shows what you know. Deep down, I'm meaner than a run-over dog. <laughs> what you're looking at now is my party manners. <laughs> you looking for? That burger was at least half a cow. Well, I guess I'm looking for the other half. <laughs> We're taking off. Here, sold all our shirts. Oh, yeah. Yeah, count it. Money don't lie. Like you the judge of what do and don't lie. I'm the judge of what is and is not stupid. <laughs> D, let's blow. Gotta get my jacket. We know Lathan been up in the price, pocket in the chain. Cause we got some mad customers wanting money back. Money we ain't got. You doing it too? No, you see, it ain't like that. It's like a loophole. You and Lathan planners, man, what's up with that? Boy, if he get right. Hey, you better get out my face. Boy, you oh, better I get out you. my face. Hey, you better, hey, hey, you don't. Hey, 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 what's up? 
Now, I know this isn't a golden glove. And what started this? Snuff. Oh, nobody's talking, huh? Look, I can't have you here if you're going to fight. Now, what's going on? You know, I was a kid once myself, and I know the old anti-rat rule. I'm just sorry to see that it's still in effect, and that you all would rather see everybody get hurt to protect one fool? Hey, come on now. I was a kid once, and I got into a lot of stuff. I might have already been where you're going. I guess you're going home, then. Let's go. Unless anybody got the courage to talk. Want to speak up? Want to chat? <laughs> oh, yeah, you gonna eat my hamburgers and just walk off like that? Anybody concerned that I may suffer terrible consternation and, and worry myself sleepless tonight? <laughs> so that would be a no. <laughs> Man, as soon as I start to understand what these kids are saying, they invent a whole bunch of new words. <laughs> Well, plan you means stealing or taking advantage. Get right means tell the truth. And loophole, that's a new one. I don't know what that means. It just might mean loophole. <laughs> so, Daniel's stealing. Now, is that such a surprise? Lathan, too. Ooh, now there's a surprise. <laughs> George, honey, what'd you expect? You think you could change these kids in one day? No. I just can't believe he'd steal from his own friend. Mm. I'm not surprised. Just... <laughs> very, very disappointed. Yeah. Uh-huh. And hurt. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. And you're beginning to wonder if your being there for them makes any difference at all. It's so frustrating. So frustrating. Then you start thinking, well, maybe I shouldn't have left that nice little private school with my newly decorated office, because these children are tougher than a truck stop steak. Are we still talking about me? No. We had progressed past you and started talking about me. I gotta go get dressed for work. Just a Vanessa, come on in. So here's the accounting book like you wanted us to keep. We'll be going now. No, hang on, hang on. Come on in. The spell, shut the door. Goodness gracious. I didn't even know they made rolls that big. What the heck size is that thing? Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean anything by it. It's a good size. It fits you. <laughs> Good. Now, cost of shirts, okay. Cost of printing, fine, that's good. Cost of angry customer refunds. Yeah, that's just no big thing. Lathan's stealing from you. We didn't say that. No, nobody said I won't worry about nobody overcharging and us having to get a cares back their money. No, no, I won't worry. Damn, <laughs> man, what did I say? Okay, so now you know. What are you gonna do about it? Me? Yeah, look, I don't want to get suspended, which I would, doing what I would do to Lathan. <laughs> but don't be too mad at him. He's not a bad guy, that's just the way he is. You're still protecting him. He's cute. Don't you think he's cute? Wait a minute, have you seen that brother's eyes? That brother got some pretty eyes, especially up close. <laughs> Shut up! Ugh. <laughs> so you got some brilliant solution? I might. Help yourself to some breakfast, and I'll see you later at the TKO. Funny thing about a solution, you never know where to find one until you find one. Oh, that's a real funny thing. Yeah, hilarious. He's like the three stooges all rolled into one. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> this is not gonna work. Well, I think it will, but then I'm only going on my gut instinct. Then I think we're safe. That's a big instinct. <laughs> Let's see if it isn't our numero uno salesman. Desgraciado. 
Chill, Ricky Ricardo. Let Lucy handle this one. <laughs> so late. Check out our new T-shirt design. Yes, sir. Mason's got a big old butt. It's gonna be a big old hit with all your friends. <laughs> We're so glad you grabbed up this popular design so quickly. Actually. We're willing to cut you a special package deal. We're going to allow you to purchase our entire stock of these beautiful T-shirts for precisely $186. Which is the exact amount you ripped off. Of course, if you're not interested, your mama says she'd take at least five for your big butt aunties in Cincinnati. <laughs> I guess it runs in the family. Here. That's two C's. Knock yourself out. Here, here's your change. We wouldn't want to rip you off. I'm counting. Hold it. You forgot your pride. What you talking about? Well, we had a little private sales contest. Seems in your enthusiasm to rip us off, you outsold everybody. When did you decide to have a sales contest? About an hour ago. <laughs> nice touch. <laughs> What's this? One of those itty bitty TVs. It's your prize for being top salesman. Took a lot of hard work. Unless somebody else helped you sell those shirts. Somebody you might want to recognize. Yeah, Lake. Taking all the credit again? You didn't tell him I helped you, because I did help you. Well, thanks for your honesty. Now, what would a piece of the American pie be without the Alamo? <laughs> Come on, let's see what your hard work got you. Check this baby out. It says CD stereo with tweaked up tweeters and woofed up woofers. <laughs> woof, woof. <laughs> Black and white? How about I sell this for something really bad? <laughs> yeah, the only thing you can watch on this thing is Lucy rerun. <laughs> <laughs> right, Ricky? Baba Lou! Hey, Ricky. Hey, Ricky. Hey, Lucy. Hey, Lucy. George, I'm really proud of you. You are? Mm-hmm. Might be hope for those children after all. You know I'm proud of me, too. Those five tough kids, they really like me. Did they say that out loud to your face? No, but they haven't burned our house down yet, so it must be something special we got. I bet they like you. I know I like you. I like you because you're funny and you're kind and you're smart. Probably a genius. Mm-hmm, a genius. Just like that, uh, oh, 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 the, the, the little white-haired guy. You know, the one with the, uh, 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 the mustache, uh, uh, split the atom? Einstein. Yeah, <laughs> genius. Just like that. Oh. <laughs> My car could escape. Bugsy, come back. Oh, there he is. Ha, ha, ha.